What's going on guys, it's Brandon here, BB's iPod Touch Up. So I'll be showing you guys three great themes for your iOS 7 jailbroken device. Now I've been getting a lot of questions lately asking me what my theme has been, uh, you know, in the past few videos, especially the jailbreak video. Everybody's been asking me what my theme has been, and I've replied to a few people, but you know, not everybody sees all the comments and what I say. So I figured I'd just make a video uh, not only showing that theme, but two of my other favorite themes as well. So the one that was in those previous videos will be the second theme I'll show, uh, so just stay tuned for that. But the first theme you may be more interested in, which is called Anique D. This is my current favorite theme. As you can see, the, uh, the uh, icons are all stylized and, you know, rounded off and the Instagram and the Facebook just look amazing. I mean, the design on all these icons is just incredible and uh, it definitely adds a lot to your device. As you can see, pretty much every app is uh, stylized. Obviously, the folders are still going to be the square shape and not stylized, but everything else is pretty much customized and it looks fantastic. Now, another great thing with this theme is that it comes with a Groovy Lock lock screen. Now, if you have not heard of Groovy Lock, go ahead to Cydia and download Groovy Lock. And once you go to your Groovy Lock in settings, right here, make sure you select the Anique D lock screen theme. And what that will give you is this awesome lock screen, which is also my favorite lock screen right now. As you can see, it looks, you know, nothing like the stock uh, lock screen on your device. You have the moving clock up here, you have your time, you have your date and day up here, and of course I have the, you have to have the clock hide, the city of clock hide, and things like that. Um, which of course you could, I'll, I'll put, actually put that in the description just to help you out. So you can get everything for your lock screen to look just like that. Now Anique D also comes with the status bar up here, as you can see uh, next to the Verizon I have the, uh, my bars up there are a different shape. And also my Wi-Fi is a different like triangle looking shape, so that also comes with the status bar. And as you can tell, there is a shadow underneath of the icons. That also comes with the theme. If you go into Winterboard, you will actually have it down here. It'll say uh, Anique D status bar, uh, shadow, and just Anique D in general. And of course, you download that. those all. Those all come with the package in City. The next theme is the one that everybody's been asking me about, and this is iShady iOS 7. Now, they've had previous versions for iOS 5 and 6. But this one actually seems to be the best one in my opinion. Now one of my favorite things on this theme is of course the background that comes with that gradient adds a lot to this theme. But also your little push notification number right here, as you can see it kind of has like a, a fade effect on it and it's really cool. It looks really cool as you can see down the dock I have it right there on the mail and the messages as well. But that really adds a lot to it and of course there are some customized uh, icons but not all of them are. Uh, you know, it's missing some of the essentials like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, but it still looks really nice. Everything flows really nice. Now, iShady also has a lot of add-ons you can get. So if you go into Cydia and just search iShady iOS 7, you can see they have iWidgets. You may not need the whole um, iOS 7 in there, but they do also have a lock screen for Groovy Lock. So you might want to get that because I will show you here in a second how awesome that is. So, if, of course, uh, like I said in the first one, if you have Groovy Lock, go into your settings and change the Groovy Lock to the iShady one. And you will get a lock screen looking amazing like this. So, as you see, it shows the weather, shows your uh, high and low down there, shows your city, partly cloudy, the date, the time, everything you want. Now, of course, you do need iFile to change the code in this theme. Uh, so, you can change it to Fahrenheit, uh, you know, 12 hour, 24 hour clock, uh, your city. You know, all that kind of stuff. Now, the last theme is called 69 Blue, and this is actually a really cool theme. It's almost like a matte black theme with uh, like little blue, uh, you know, outlines for the applications. Not all of them, though. As you see, it's missing Vine, AdSense, things like that. But it does circulate them, and as you can see, it cuts off a little part of it. It looks really cool. Now, this may not look the best on a blue background, so you can actually go to, as you can see, it has loading screens, too. You can actually go online and find black backgrounds if you want uh, because it doesn't actually come with one. Or you can just set it as the default one. I'll just set this as a home screen so you can see it does look a little bit better like that. Uh, it looks best with the black background uh, just because everything is black and it looks really nice. But this also does come with some uh, some sliders up top as you can see my Wi-Fi uh, my Wi-Fi and my Verizon bar is right up there. It also comes with those loading screens as you saw. Now one thing I did not like about this is actually if you go into your camera you will see that this backdrop is over top of the videos. Let me go, let me find a video real quick. I don't know if you can tell, as you can see right there, I'm not sure if you could tell, but there is a slight little indent right there, just a little backdrop. 
that's just me racing another car but as you can see right there i'm not again i'm not sure if you can really see that but there is a backdrop on there and it does kind of take away from the video it kind of distracts you i really you. like the theme i really like the icons and everything but that is the only downfall for me again it may not be a big deal to you uh but that's just personal opinion and of course i kept the eye shady groovy lock because it is one of my favorites so that's it guys thanks for watching did you enjoy the themes did you download the themes why or why not let me know. Any feedback is welcome. And let me know what you want for the next video. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. Peace.